Welcome back to the broadcast. Okay, I'm just a little bit giddy because the man standing next to me has designed the floral displays for so many amazing events, celebrities, weddings, star-studded occasions. His name is Jeff Lethem, and he is in Dallas for an appearance at Neiman Marcus later today with your gorgeous, gorgeous line of vases. They're just beautiful. I'm very proud. I'm like a proud daddy, yeah? so to speak. So the, this is florology uh, with Waterford Crystal. And um, this is something that really holds close to my heart. Uh, we've worked on this for the last two years, uh, actually going to Waterford and Ireland to the factory, working with their amazing design team and creating these uh, vases called uh, Florology, and uh, we rock it out. So and we really wanted to bring something different to the line that's special that people can use with flowers. And this is kind of a culmination now of your intense love of flowers and For sure, how yeah. that kind of morphed. And I was just looking in your book and reading your story. So growing up in Utah, Utah your, boy, your dad is a landscape architect. Yeah, exactly. And you grew up kind of on a ranch for most yeah. of the year. And so you have this kind of love of the earth and all things natural. Well, and kind of flowers fell into my life um, on accident because I was living in Europe. I was modeling in Europe and I came back and I, I didn't have a job. So someone said to me, you know, there's a job at a flower shop, do you want to do it? And so my passion grew and then I started with the Four Seasons Hotel group in Beverly Hills. And then when they reopened the George Sank in Paris, I moved there as the artistic director for the company. Right. So, um, which just kind of exploded which my career. Which is just kind of a little bit of exactly. a job, just a tiny little so job. So in that, yeah. you know, <laughs> opportunities like that in Paris really led me, um, when the team of Waterford came to Paris and they saw my flowers, they really said, you know, we should do something with, with him working with flowers and our cuts. So really when we started working with the vases, we wanted to create something that's so special. So when they hand blow these vases, for example, because I'm, as you can I'm, see, I'm they're so it. heavy. I gotta tell you, I'm really afraid to So hold when it. they hand blow them in the factory, there's no way for them to make vases. And in speaking to customers of Waterford, we really wanted to create something that was larger. So this is called the Tina vase, after my client and my friend Tina Turner. Um, her wedding is actually in the book. Did um, she, what was her reaction when you said, I'm naming this after she you? She just shook and she said, Jeff, yeah. Jeff, I love this. I love it. I love it. I love it. So, but really working with her, um, we really wanted to create something that's unique, strong, like she is, the woman she yeah. is. So, and we created these and so that they stack on top of each other. So, which is like the so Tina vase and, and the Kylie vase, which is named after my buddy Kylie Minogue. So, it has these gaskets and so people stack all the time, but with the gaskets in them, you don't chip the vase. And, and it so has a little lip on the bottom of each one. And it has a little lip one, and you right. can stack them really high and do different things. So this Beautiful. is the Tina collection and then this is the Kylie collection and you can mix the crystal with the black and it all works, I mean. Gorgeous, and I especially really, as you're trying to layer. Exactly, you know. and it was important for me to create a collection with Waterford that I would actually use in yeah. my own home. So I definitely have these in my own home and I'm so proud to like show them to everyone. And so. you do, didn't you just uh, add the Kardashians to your, your growing list Did. of, of celebrity friends? I'm doing the, friends. the Kardashians homes uh, for Christmas mm -hmm. um, in LA. Just moved my office. I'm still obviously with the Four Seasons in Paris uh, there, but my office is in LA now. So doing the Kardashians homes uh, for Christmas. So it's, I have pretty, I have a crazy life. I kind of you look at it sometimes. You have a great life. And, like, and aren't you being knighted? Are you kidding me? You said you're being knighted, knighted next week in Paris. Oh my gosh. I know. So like the last American to get knighted, I think it was Robert Redford from Utah. So we yeah. have a little Utah connection. That connection. So when we found out I was getting knighted, I was like, are you kidding me? Is that really me? So once I got over the shock, it's okay. So you know what I really love, Jeff, is like stories like yours when, you know, when you talk about you were modeling in Paris, you, you came back, you weren't sure what you were going to do. You totally reinvented yourself yeah. and have such a success story. And we talk about that a lot on our show because I know there are people at home that like, will be so inspired by that. This book, can we talk about the book For, really quickly? Sure. Because this is gorgeous. And you just did an event in uh, um, Fort Worth. I just did an event in Fort Worth yesterday for the Garden Club. Um, this is uh, my new book that just came out last week, uh, Visionary Floral Art and Design. And there's just great, great photos in here of, you know, of the hotel. There's great photos of, uh, of the vases, for example. Like there's some cool. And all the beautiful places, especially in that Paris, we've done, that we've done in Paris, and we've worked. Like these are the Let's these are the Waterford these. vases here in the book. Let me hold that up. Yeah. This one's the Cleo vase, named after my grandmother. And then we have cool things in here. Like I don't know if you see Tina's wedding. So there's Tina Turner's wedding in here, and it's just really that's Tina's wedding. Oh. So here with much inspiration. 145,000 roses we use there. You know, I told you so I'm getting Eva married Longoria's next year. Eva Longoria's wedding. The and only thing that lasted from her marriage were the flowers oh. with Tony, so it's okay. So <laughs> it it's all right. Beautiful. But I'll be at Neiman's today, so please yes. come down and have everyone come down to Neiman's. And downtown. will they have an opportunity to get your beautiful book as well? 
Uh, I believe so, but most importantly, the, the florology line will be down there. I'll be at Neiman's all afternoon. Gorgeous. Ready to meet people, show Gorgeous. them the vases. I'll be actually playing with flowers down there today. Oh, and showing the some demonstrations. Showing, yeah. So Fantastic. I have my babies and we're all there, so it's all good. Oh, so exciting, Jeff. Okay, you can meet Jeff and pick up a Waterford piece for yourself this afternoon at the downtown Neiman Marcus store uh, location from 2 until 4 o'clock. And for more details, uh, just go to the broadcasttv.com, click on today's links. But we have a little surprise. Okay, so because Jeff and all the nice folks from Neiman Marcus are giving away this piece, I believe the amethyst. Yeah, the Tina Vaz. Yeah. The Tina Vaz in amethyst. Uh, they're giving this away to caller number 10 right now. Are we taking callers now? <laughs> yes, we caller are? number 10 okay, right now go. is going to win at the number 800 994 1547. Caller number 10 gets it. And oh, what a beautiful piece it is. And I feel like just because they stack, you need to, you need to just add to the collection. You've exactly. got the first one, now add to it. And Jeff, come and visit you. us today. We're a good time. Yeah. Come well, down to Neiman's. I, I'm coming down there. Yeah, let's uh, You've go. inspired me. Yeah, and we'll bring the wine with us. Gr they have some great, I, how have great I gone my whole Waterford life? Crystal wine glasses. I've gone glasses. my whole life without yeah, knowing exactly. you. This is crazy. I know. <laughs> Okay. Neiman's, wine glasses, Waterford Crystal. You're it's my all favorite there. person, and you're about to be a knight, so there's that. Uh, when we come back, we are talking about a wonderful way to raise money while picking yourself up something fantastic. It's the partner's card. It's back. Love this time of year. Learn about all of it next.